Hi, my name is Lauren Lane. I am an atheist, an artist, and an all-around good person. Yes, um, I'm the co-founder of Skepticon. You can find out more about Skepticon at www.skepticon.org. It is a large atheist conference in the Midwest, Springfield, Missouri to be exact. Anyway, shameless plug over, I'm here to talk about atheism, or rather how I found it or it found me. When I was young, uh, my parents took me to church on and off. I would say my mother made a valiant effort to take my brother and I, but we stopped when I was in about third grade. I don't remember much about church except that we, uh, we ate jelly donuts, which was awesome, and we played with toys, which was also awesome, and sometimes we had to listen to really, really long, long, long conversations. Um, well, it wasn't really a conversation, it was more like a guy talking to us about the guy upstairs or the girl upstairs, or the thing, the thing that's supposed to be upstairs. Um, I would say that religion was kind of off my radar for the majority of my young life until I was in college and I met JT, and um, I figured out there was this thing called atheism, and it's awesome. And uh, from there on, you know, that's, I guess that was my aha moment. It was more like, a, oh, this is a thing, and people are really riled up on both sides of the issue, and I definitely stand over here with these guys. Kind of thing. Um, my uh, my immediate family is pretty pretty cool about it. They uh, they still love me and accept me as a as an atheist. And I don't think I had the whole sit down conversation and go, hey, mom and dad, I'm a godless heathen kind of thing with them. But it, with hints about my various activities in college, you know, making Skepticon, um, doing the flying spaghetti monster thing, where we would dress up as pirates and protest the, uh, the guys who would come to our campus and proselytize. Uh, they, they figured it out pretty quick because I'm, I'm none too subtle with, with the hints. And um, so things are good. My, my coming out of the closet experience, uh, as you could say for an atheist, was actually pretty good. And um, I know it can't it be that way for everybody. And um, regardless, I, I, I highly encourage anyone who is hesitant about coming out as an atheist or saying that they are an atheist to do so because there is such a loving, fun, energetic, smart community waiting for you and you really shouldn't miss out on it.